yes, yes, yes. Shelter for uh, the See you. We'll see you. Yes. yes. Okay, uh, this is Power Profit. Power Profit is smart. Okay. And for, uh, smart switch up to 33 amps, so it's a very powerful switch. This is a also a um, smart switch with channels here. So you have 5 times 10 amps, 5 times, uh, what do I say, nominal 6 amps of switching. Now also protected switches, high side switches. Uh, how much uh, the current and how much voltage? Um, in this case, the voltage is called, it's a real 24 volt product, so you have nominal range up to 33 volts. 8 to 33 volts, um, nominal load. The, the current, the nominal current, they are different products. This is the two different types of switches from, I think it's something like 6 to um, 10 amps. We're talking about 7 amp um, nominal current, yes. So 7 and 5 amps, 7 and 5 amps nominal current. Perfect. Yes. So uh, be useful to use these, uh, uh, this switch, this switch shell with, uh, for example, motor for 3D printer. For example, yes. Okay. And uh, uh, it's possible to control um, the, the, the current uh, in time to know how much current is flowing yes. through the motor. They have so-called so current sensing inside, yes. Okay. Both, this and this. So there's a sense pin. If you look at this here, yes. We have a sense pin where I, I don't see where is it input 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 here we go yeah this is a sense pin and then you you just directly connect it to your microcontroller to your ADC in the microcontroller and you can evaluate the the, the actual current which is in the load path and the question of the accuracy it's something like um, 10 to 15 percent accuracy but you can actually um, um, what do you call this um, them. You can adapt it. You can do, let's say, measurements or what do you call it, calibrate it. Yes, okay. calibration, and you're getting a, a better resolution. Perfect. Yeah. Perfect. And the same concept is, is for this switch. The same also the current sense. It's also in here. Perfect. Okay, it's, it's not easy to switch the light. Uh, only for light. Uh, yeah, only for light. Yes, it's, but it's it's it's, it's really not easy to if you want to dim it. Make it less bright. LEDs are difficult to, to control. They, they start to glimmer. Yeah. Perfect. And this this device or so this this shield with the specific hardware um, module on the, on the microcontroller it make, takes care that the device is not flickering. Okay. And you can dim it. You can produce all kinds of, of colors. Okay. Perfect. And the uh, sport. I don't really know about it. It's, it's a XMCT Power Explorer kit where you can uh, program and switch power low of um, microcontroller like the XMC 1000 and the XMC 4000. You can switch and exchange this, this shield. It's for DC, DC applications, power applications. Um, it's in T130. So it's a bug boost concept, I think, what you what you can what you are buying. Uh, using it. 